नेक्स्ट विल स्टडी मैग्नेटिक मूवमेंट और डाइपोल मूवमेंट कैपिटल एम द मैग्नेटिक मूवमेंट इज डिफाइंड एज द प्रोडक्ट ऑफ पोल स्ट्रेंथ एंड द शॉर्टेस्ट डिस्टेंस बिटवीन द पोल्स ऑफ अ मैग्नेट इट इज रिप्रेजेंट द स्ट्रेंथ ऑफ द मैग्नेट द प्रोडक्ट ऑफ द स्ट्रेंथ ऑफ आइदर पोल एंड एफेक्टिव लेंथ इट रिप्रेजेंट द स्ट्रेंथ ऑफ मैग्नेट द मैग्नेटिक मूवमेंट इज गिवन बाई कैपिटल एम इज डिफाइंड एज द प्रोडक्ट of the pole strength and the shortest distance between the poles of the magnet that is the effective length so capital m is equal to small m into 2l 2l is the effective length that is the distance from north pole to south pole this is the effective length 2l the pole strength is given as m m into 2l is called the magnetic moment assign it ampere meter into meter ampere meter square dimension formula al square si unit ampere meter square am square dimensional formula al square the magnetic moment capital m is a pseudo vector it points from the south towards north pole later we'll study the torque acting on the bar magnet is equal to cross product of magnetic moment and the magnetic field vector the direction of magnetic moment we will define from this particular relation resultant magnetic moments if you take two identical bar magnet each of magnetic moment capital m placed in a line with the resultant magnetic moment will be 2m if two identical magnets each of moment capital m are placed in a line the resultant magnetic moment is 2m so magnetic moment of one magnetic moment of other become 2m the magnetic moment if we have three magnets three identical magnets but this time we are going to join forming a triangle with unlike poles at each corner so we'll join it like this north pole south pole this is south pole north pole here south pole north pole unlike pole each other at the corners facing each other the resultant magnetic moment is zero the so magnetic moment of one line will be like this this magnetic moment line will be from south to north this magnetic moment line will be in this direction so magnetic moment will be equal to zero if two identical magnet each of moment capital m are placed with unlike poles together with angle theta between their axes then the resultant magnetic moment will be equal to 2m sin theta by 2 if like poles are together then resultant magnetic moment will be 2m cos theta by 2 if a bar magnet is bent in the form of an arc subtending an angle theta radian at the center the new magnetic moment will be 2m sin theta by 2 divided by theta when a bar magnet is cut into two halves by cutting it perpendicular to its axis remember the pole strength does not change but magnetic moment is half if two bar magnets of moments m1 and m2 are placed at an angle theta when like poles are touching the resultant magnetic moment will be under root of m1 square plus m2 square plus 2 m1 m2 cos theta and when unlike poles are touching m1 square plus m2 square minus 2 m1 m2 cos theta for unlike poles this will be under root of m1 square plus m2 square minus 2 m1 m2 cos theta